The reason for the travel is to explore the planet, uncover diverse cultures of other people, but most important, discover ourselves. This is Around the Globe. I'm not the expert here, this is uh, Miguel, who's the coach for Wim Hof um, breathing and uh, ice bath. So it's something uh, that works physically and also uh, psychologically as well, but I'm sure Miguel can do a better explanation than me. So this is the Wim Hof, Wim Hof technique for breathing. So, I think it's correct to say <clears throat> we do deep breaths and little exhalations in order to oxygenate the body, oxygenate all the cells and alkaline the body. And then we blow out all the air and we hold the air. We hold nothing. So what you do, you activate the primitive part of the brain, like the reptilian brain, as I understand. <clears throat> so your body now is thinking, your brain is thinking, it's not breathing. So it, it's an emergency. The body is dying because it's not breathing. It doesn't know that you have been breathing for minutes, deep exhalation, so you oxygenate all your cells, so you can actually hold your breath. But the primitive brain doesn't know this. It's like a crocodile, it just reacts. So it reacts by cleaning out the body because it needs to survive, so right. it wants right. to clean everything to make it functional. So the idea is get rid of any waste products, any cancer cells and damaged cells and things like this, you clean it out. So that's the, the reason behind the deep breaths and then the exhalation. I hope I did it justice, as I say, I'm not an expert, so you can check it out more, we Hof breathing. And this is what we do before we go into it. We, we go into the ice bath afterwards, yeah. yeah, so we're kind of preparing with the deep breathing. We do some movement as well to warm up a little bit. And then we go in there and then do some movement afterwards as well. So it's a combination of the breathing, a little bit of movement and the uh, ice bath. And that's the Wim Hof system and the guy has done reckless stuff. I find that the deep breathing helps me with a little anxiety. I wake up in the morning, I feel a little anxious, I do the breathing and straight away you feel your body just yeah. go into relaxation. So it's great for that as well. All right, let's do it. <clears throat> so, as I said, I'm not an expert. I haven't done all the training. I just learned what I learned from the internet, really. I'm watching Wim Hof on a lot of podcasts, including London Real, which I'm on, and uh, Joe Rogan, which I'm also on, but I haven't met Wim and I haven't been trained properly, but uh, Mikael is a certified coach from Wim Hof, so he can tell us more and, uh, about the benefits. Yes. Over to you, Mikael. Yes, so today we're basically just doing one of the techniques of, of Wim Hof. So basically the, the three pillars of the Wim Hof method is based on three pillars. You have like a Dorian will explain, you have the first pillar is basically the breathing. The, the breathing basically uh, down pretty much the, the benefit, it's, it's, has, it's strengthened your cardiovascular. It's what Dorian said basically, you also add uh, basically ox oxygen to your muscle tissue. So that basically alkaline your, your, your body. So it just helps you to be, uh, to be in optimal uh, state. It makes you stronger. You have a release of dopamine. So basically it's extremely, so it helps anyone concerning depression or because basically you stabilize your emotion and have a better focus and attention. And the core benefit have a lot of benefit boosting your immune system, build your mental strength because of that discomfort. 
bring you back to present, high level of energy. So, so that are pretty much the benefit. But so, so you have the cold exposure on one side, you have the mindset, the concentration towards meditation, and you have the breathing. They all link, but they can be worked separately. The main added value basically to work with the, um, the cold is basically because you're quite prepared. When you, the fact that you add more oxygen to your muscle tissue, what happens is that basically you, you, your body is alkaline, so you feel less pain when you go to the cold. It's pretty much the only benefit besides the fact that you slow down your breathing, so you come more towards your, 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 para, yeah, your, your peripheric uh, nervous system autonomy, so more towards the, uh, the parasympathetic nervous system. So it slows down your, your breath. So that are the two link. And the breathing, basically, the one we're going to do is one. There's advanced breathing, basic breathing. Today we're going to do the basic breathing of Wim Hof. It's basically three phases. You have a venting phase, where basically we tap into the, the sympathetic nervous system, we rise up the adrenaline. So we have 30, 40 uh, breath. Then we have a retention. What happens during the, the retention is that the adrenaline basically go down. And then we have a code where we recover. So basically what happened during that, 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 that step is that we, we rise the adrenaline level. Like if you had basically a bungee jump, the only difference that you, you, you know, that's, that's on the stress level is the same, yeah. that you're more conscious. And then what happened is that instead of keeping rising the, the adrenaline, that what we basically uh, bring up to, to cortisol and it's what causes basically uh, stress for most of the people. So what we, inflammation, burnout is what basically our adrenaline is just keeping rising all the time. So that breathing is quite intelligent because what happens is that you basically reset your hormone system and uh, by influencing the, uh, the adrenaline level. And uh, it was quite fascinating because before we basically, we, we thought we couldn't impact the autonomic nervous system. And we basically what shows is that basically we can have an influence the autonomic system you know, we have influence on our immune system so that it's uh, it's it's pretty much the base and then there's more advanced uh, breathing that breathing is more towards the parasympathetic nervous system so we calm down it's a breathing we have a tendency to make us a bit cooler so we have other advanced breathing or you want to eat up of the body so that's pretty much the uh, yeah the line the line of the method so the three pillar basically we are breathing ice exposure gradually and the mindset and the concentration and then different breathing basic breathing advanced is basically in your fire the power breath we eating up the body and the last breathing is basically really similar to the tumor method in a, it's, a, it's a meditation method from the monk basically but but with Wim Hof we do it a little bit differently so the, the main goal of, uh, of the, the, the the last breathing is basically uh, it's to activate your brown fat. So it's heating up the body, and, and so it's just uh, becoming easier to recover by heating up the body. So we do it before or okay. after the session. Yeah. Voila. <laughs>
Start to see the tunnel. It, it started like the brain started to say, yeah, yeah. Tell me something, you know? yeah, the yeah. It's, it's, it didn't go far away. It's just like I it's started light. to feel it. It's like, like, I like, I know this feeling I got. This, yeah. you know, it was a unique feeling that, you know, and it's free. Let go and breathe. Deep breath in, five in, five out. Slow down, slow down. Don't hold your breath. Just use your mind now when you're breathing. Just slow down, slow down, that's it. Don't hold, don't hold your breath, keep breathing. You will pass, you will pass. Slow down. You're doing great. Let's see, two more minutes, just 12 slow deep breaths. One minute to go. Oh, 
for five, four, three, two, one. That's it, guys. Well done. At the end of the meditation, just force. Are you on? Yes. No, 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 I didn't know if you were three or four or five or six. So we came to a meditation class, this is a private class we were having with me and my friends. Um, I've never been in one of these before, so I really don't know what to expect. Robert, have you been in one? You've done this before, right? You've done it a few times. So what should we expect? Um, well, I think one of the things is you've got to clear your mind and, and you get the more you clear your mind and the more present you are the more you, you get out of it. So if you, if you clear your mind and you're just open to everything, then you literally, I mean, I've had experiences which are not far off, sort of psychedelic stuff, okay. you know, sort of. Uh, I hope you have a good experience. Yeah. 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 Let's see what happens. Okay. Bye. I had just a 
calm down, let it go, and forget all the things that you did, like work and stress and so on. But after the 45 minutes, the last 15, 10 minutes uh, was pretty amazing. I was, I forgot this world basically. I was out there somewhere thinking. It was kind of like a really fast memory lane throughout my life. It's it's kind of personal what happened. It was a unique experience, and we're booking another one for the next week because I definitely want to feel this again. I want to experience a lot more. What did you feel? Uh, yeah, I mean, um, I'm I'm not working at the moment. I'm just having some time out from work, so I'm in a very sort of uh, relaxed state of doing meditation and yoga sometimes and stuff. So I sort of slipped straight into it and. Uh, yeah, I was like Timo was saying, you know, you go off into all these places and you go beyond the body and beyond like the material world and you I mean, sort of the, the, the sound and the vibrations is so powerful through your body that you, you just end up, it's like very, you know, our teacher was telling us it's very healing and uh, yeah, so you can actually feel everything rebalancing the energies in your body. So. It, uh, I'm feeling great already, I'm feeling more clear-minded, I'm feeling less stressed, less irritable, I'm feeling good, I'm feeling happy, I'm feeling clean, and um, I'm, we're going to do a longer session next time with a thing called the Diksha Blessing, Oneness Blessing, which is uh, like one of the most amazing things I've ever had done, had it done the first time in New York, uh, it actually made me cry for about half an hour, but I felt so much lighter and less stressed afterwards, so yeah, we're going to be doing that. Yeah, what I forgot to say was that the sounds that the instructor yeah, yeah. did really helped me to calm down my body. Like it was yeah. like they were really strong the vibrations that I felt throughout my body and yeah. different sounds kind of like brought deep, brought different memories to my head. It was like yeah. the sounds are really powerful. You really feel it in sessions like this. For, for sure, yeah. man. Uh, you don't you don't realize that you've done something. How powerful the sound is. What an effect it has on you. Every bit of music you listen to obviously can change your emotions. But obviously that's a science what she's doing. You know, this is a science that's come from India, places like that, and it really is. Uh, yeah, really powerful stuff. So feeling good. I'm glad you, you enjoyed it as well. Yeah. Look forward to the next time. Yeah, me too. <laughs> So this concludes our episode of breathing, relaxing practice and ice bath treatment. Um, the whole experience was a little bit different than I was expecting. Um, I have done breathing exercises before, but this time when I had a tutor who was helping me push through them, actually helped me out with the benefits because uh, once you feel that fatigue where you have huge urge to breathe in, um, someone helping on the side telling you to relax and staying calm and fighting the urge to breathe in actually helps you to hold the breath a couple more seconds and it made huge benefits for me for having um, better feeling overall from the breathing exercise the feelings after these two treatments um, i've experienced some uh, blood circulation improvements um, everything seems a little bit more clear um, my body temperature is a little different. I can feel it that there's actually really warm inside, but I'm not sweating. And I feel fresh. I feel like I drank five cups of coffee. Like I feel energetic. So this was a unique experience. Thank you for watching this episode. Please be sure to subscribe to the channel so you won't miss the next episode. Thank you and I'll catch you on the flip side.